Zimbabwe 26. This is part 6 of my walkthrough of Pokemon Diamond. No part 2 Jubilee City is not a typo because it's just in this video I'm just going to do a tour of Jubilee City just sh to show where everything is. <coughs> Pokemon Center. This Pokemon Center, as you know, is a building with a red roof. Trainer school, and really anything in here. Here is the GTS, Global Training Station. She's not allowing you because you don't have a badge. Yeah. But in the Global Training Station, what you can do, basically, you could trade your Pokemon like on, on Wi Fi if you have Wi Fi connection. Uh. Well, yeah. For an Abra, like let's say you want to catch an Abra, like I mentioned before, the way to make it evolve, and the way to get it to evolve into an Alakazam, would be to trade it. I'll show a video on that way, I want to get to that point, just to put in better detail. And I'll just put the tech building. The interview that the lady has is not really important. Here in this building, guy with the red hat. Talk to him, he'll give you an old rod. It's basically just fishing pole. Old rod is the first rod out of all of this. Very well. Even if you say no when you have to explain it to you, don't do anything. Anyway. If you want to fish, you could go right there in the water on the other side of the building. This building right here. Talk to a girl next to the two little Pokemon walking around. She gives you a quick claw. A quick claw. What it does is you equip it to a Pokemon, and it can make them move first occasionally. Like it'd be like what you want to do. Either just give it to your first party member, or you could just give it to your slowest guy so when you put them in they don't like lose. Like they get to attack first and it's just easier to win that way. If yeah, you saw the boy is talking about that right by that's your friend. Which, in my case, is noob. Yeah, there goes the tour of Jube Life, and now here's a battle with noob. <coughs> this battle shouldn't be too difficult if you have trained you guys to decent level. See, the story on level 7, I believe, Pip Up is on level 11. Maybe. Or something like that. Okay, if you just have like two guys on a decent level, you should be fine. Even one would probably be enough to train them. See, sorry, it wasn't that difficult. Push them down. See, the only two moves that Pip-Up is really going to do is Growl, which lowers your attack. But Ember, if you have Chimchar, is a special attack, so it doesn't affect that whatsoever. Growl and Pound. So, it's okay if you have Chimchar out, because it's not really going to do serious damage. Because it can't do any water moves to you. But you can still change it if you want to... Just like level the other guys up.
private new orber gym that is where the first gym leader is. Uh, you will continue to go uh, right on the map, but I'm going to end this video. So, once again, thank you for watching. Please rate and tell me what you think about it in the comments. Like a ninja, cause that's what ninjas do. I'm gonna flip up like a ninja, and you should flip out too.